Hi, this is Carmen. I'm going to show a, an Android app that demonstrates remote logging using Dropio. This app is geared toward developers who are waiting for the Android phone and want to capture certain information when uh, either an error happens or the user does something on the site, on their app, and uh, they, they need a place for that to happen. Um, the choices are I can update the demo log, and that's what I'm going to show you today, how, the, how to update the demo log, view the log in the browser, um, we can do it on the phone or on the web. Uh, a video, which is this. Um, getting Droid Drop, which is a, another Dropio client. And upgrading your drop. A default drop comes with 100 meg. You can up, upgrade your drop for more space and, and uh, more capabilities. I'm going to go right to the update demo log. And again, this is geared toward developers. I can create an exception. In the code, I'm doing a divide by zero. I'm catching the, catching the exception and logging it on Dropio. So I'm just going to click that button. And we see over here that the update log code uh, says divide by zero, java.lang.arithmetic ex exception. This is what I put into my, my Java code on Android to capture this on Dropio. I'm also going to do a sample where um, i just do some user test input. I'm capturing that as well. I'm going to add that to the user log. So what we see here is that things that happen on the phone through code are immediately coming up in the Dropio uh, log. And this is my log, Droid Drop Remote Log. Dropio.io, Droid Drop Remote Log. Um, on this TalkingAndroid.com site, I'll be putting up information on how you can incorporate this into your own apps and, um, and create your own drop for, for remote logging. Um, and really quickly, I'll show you how to view the log um, from the phone. So this is Dropio on the Droid Drop Remote Log in the uh, mobile view. So, you know, if you found that uh, a lot of errors were coming up on your site or you wanted to just check your logs, you could do it right from the phone. So that's it. Uh, this is going to be Droid Drop Remote Log. We'll be able to search for Droid Drop in the Android market. It should be there soon. Definitely geared toward developers who want to do remote logging um, from their applications.